Stone Hunter with you. Coming up this hour, Tina Turner. Also, John Fogarty's sneak preview video. Right now, though, we're off to the Zappa house where Dweezil will get us into his latest video. Today's the big day. Dweezil Zappa. Let's talk about it. Take one. What'd you think? That was pretty darn impressive, wasn't it? Did you see all the people? Can you believe the kind of caliber of people that I got to be in this video? I can't believe it myself. In fact, I was so great. Let's do it again. Dweezil Zappa, let's talk about it. Take one.
Well, what can I say? Right here on this channel, MTV, you just saw a dual world premiere. You got to see it twice. That, that's never been done before. That's pretty darn impressive. They must like me enough to let me do it because, uh, well, let's just say they, they, they had a little bit to do with this video, shall we? Mm -hmm. My little friend here, we, all, we just want to say goodbye. And uh, next time you see the video, look for, look for the cameraman. It's Vince Neal, folks. And so you can see the video again tonight at 10 p.m. Eastern Time. And uh, if you missed Vince Neal the first time around, check him out tonight, won't you? I'm Alan Hunter with you. Music news right here. Michael Jackson has been in New York City this week laying down some tracks for his new album. Uh, he's, he's also shot scenes for his new video, which is called Bad, in New York City's Harlem section. And our crowd of over a thousand onlookers gathered as Michael went through his paces before the camera, uh, only a few blocks away from the legendary Apollo Theater. Bad is being directed by filmmaker Martin Scorsese, whose credits include, of course, Raging Bull, uh, After Hours, most recently, The Color of Money. Bad will be Michael's on Michael's new album, which is due out in February. Well, you've heard of the Hollywood Walk of Fame for actors. Well, rock and roll now has its own celebrity sidewalk in Hollywood called the Rock Walk. Yes, that's not walk like W-O-K as in Chinese, but the Rock Walk. It uh, honors musicians, innovators, and promoters who have made a lasting contribution to rock and roll. Eddie Van Halen and Stevie Wonder were the first musicians to be honored. And last week, Little Richard put his hands in cement and signed his name. A little Richard told Music News how he felt about the tribute. I feel fantastic. It's a good feeling. I feel... I'm just glad to be alive at this time. Yes, I'm glad that I'm still here, and I'm glad that I had the opportunity to make my new album, Lifetime Friends for Warner Brothers, and my new single, Somebody's Coming, produced by Lenny Wanaka. I just love to be in here. Isn't it wonderful? <laughs> and my new book is... And I'll be on tour next week. I'm going to have a new line of tennis shoes, too. Content information, Cindy Lauper, Eddie Money. Next Wednesday is when the uh, shortly delayed Cindy Lauper tour will be uh, out on the road. Delayed about a month. You could wait that long, couldn't you? Videos coming up from Genesis and also Tina Turner within just about 20 minutes. for your approval. A new show destined to be the fastest, crankiest speed race on television. MTV's Friday Night Party Zone. A non-stop party crammed with hotter videos, dancing videos, and blocks of videos from your favorite artists. Impress a date. Impressed. Drive your family out of the house. Or simply dance till your face falls off. Enter the Friday Night Party Zone. Friday night after the countdown. 10 Eastern, 9 Central. Only on MTV.